What's up, everybody? So this is going to be a reading for the earth signs. I actually did earth yesterday when um, I uploaded uh, water and fire. But for some reason, I don't know, earth sign video was tripping. So, yeah. So I was trying to, up, I mean, you know, while I was on live. So, I don't know. Anywho, so this is for the earth signs. Anywhere in your chart, moon, rising, Venus. I advise watching all of your placements, like, well, your moon, your rising, and your Venus. All right, so let's see what's up with the earth side. Earth sign messages. Knight of Wands. Earth sign messages. Earth sign. What are the messages from Earth signs? Whoa. So we got the Knight of Pentacles. These two came out. But I think this one came out first. And then <laughs> the Three of Pentacles, the full card. Now. This is how I feel like the cards came out, okay? So let's see if this makes sense. We have one more. We have one more card for the earth sign. Divine Holy Spirit. Divine Holy Spirit. Queen of Swords. Strength card at the bottom, earth sign. So let's clarify this Knight of Wands for the first time. Can I get a clarifier for the Knight of Wands, please? Let's clarify this Knight of Wands. Clarify this Knight of Wands. Oops. Uh, hmm. Clarify this Nine of Pentacles. Clarify this Nine of Pentacles, please. Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Okay. Now I take all the cards. Clarify the Three of Pentacles, please. Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles, please. Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles, please. Can I get it clarified for the Three of Pentacles? Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Clarify this full card. Clarify this Queen of Swords. Clarify the queen of Oh wow, three cards. A lot of clarifiers. Alright, so let me get a card, a goddess card for you guys. Clarify this Knight of Wands in this divine intervention. Well, no, clarifiers. One more. You have one. Um, you have one. Thank you. Yeah, I'm all messed up today. All right, so we got at the bottom of the deck, we have prosperity. Um, the universe is pouring its abundance out to you. Be open to receiving. Some of you guys got some financial stuff that's coming in. Yeah, some of you guys have some money coming in. Then we have Mayat, fairness. This situation will be handled in a fair and just manner. 
whatever that pertains to, you know how that pertains to your life. Earth signs. So there's anxiety around some stuff. Everything is good. Everything's going to be good for everybody. All right, let's see what's going on because that's a lot of clarifiers. So I feel like some of you guys, let me see what's at the bottom of the deck strength card some of you guys are definitely dealing with a leo or definitely have that somewhere strong in your chart earth signs but um this looks like for some of you guys somebody leaving a situation but i see it going this way it's weird could be because a third party I'm just saying that's one that's just something I was called to see that so and somebody's moving fast it's definitely somebody with earth in fire in their chart heavy there's divine intervention clarifying this knight of wands it could be this relationship possibly with a fire in and in an earth sign and this nine of pentacles gives me energy of somebody who is trying to flourish, who is to trying to work on their independence, who's working on themselves, who's into, you know, into spirituality, like it's just so grounded, financially, spiritually grounded. And she's, she's independent, right? And this is her newfound energy. And because of this, this person is moving away fast or she's making this person move away fast, man and woman. And some of you guys just could have to do with a third party. Don't have to. Don't have to be up. But there could be a relationship. Yeah, definitely ending. There's something that's ending. But this is divinely orchestrated. This has and needs to happen. This has to happen. No matter what the situation is, stay strong in your faith. Stay strong in your faith. Because this is you. The Nine of Pentacles really don't need nobody. Right? Clarified by the Spiritual Path card. Natural beauty and authenticity. And divine life purpose. This is why she, you're, somebody's at the Nine of Pentacles energy. They're aligning themselves with what they're trying to pull in on and they're, they're aligning themselves to their destiny. They're aligning themselves for what they are getting ready to come and get, what they're getting ready to have. This is that nine of pentacles with the spiritual path, natural beauty and authenticity and divine life purpose. This is you being into complete alignment with what you're getting ready to get our signs. And, and for some of you guys, it's, yeah, in a good way. This is absolutely beautiful. That's why you're not tripping about this. Hi, Pooh. Oh, that's fine. Be careful, okay? Thank you. <laughs> so that's why you're not worried about this. This person leaving, whatever. Probably somebody that needed to leave a long time ago anyways. Our signs to tell you the truth. But you're not worried about that. Because boom, here you go. Earth, remember, and this could be for Earth Moon, Earth Sun, Earth Rising, and Earth Venus. Just keep that in mind. Hmm. So for some of you guys, you guys have like a joint venture come. This is the center. So I feel like there's going to be some collaborations going on for some of you guys coming up soon. Could just be with three people. But it just, I mean, it depends. Like people are going to want to work with you. You know what I'm saying? People want to work with you. Earth signs. People want to collaborate because they see you as abundant. They see you as abundant. Trust me. People don't have to tell you. You can, you know, 
Ja, det er nok det til at Hmm. But people see you as abundant. Most definitely. Prosperity. Three of Pentacles. What else? Somebody getting baptized. Is somebody getting baptized? When the church was open back, of course. So, hmm. this feels like somebody advising two people, like some type of mediation thing for some of you guys. That's what that feels like. That's what this three of pentacles feels like right now. This is three people, could be a, 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 some other earth sign, one or two or three earth signs that could be helping you. Like when you guys collaborate, maybe that can help you, you know, and, um, or somebody may help somebody like a loan or something, but this feels like some type of like exchange of money. Maybe a person is paying out two different people or so, it's something with money. Most definitely. You bet that. And this, whatever this is, so say this is some money somebody's getting ready to get. This puts you on that journey, that fool's journey. Starts you off with that. Taking a leap of faith. I don't know why I'm seeing this reading going this way. Like, you know what I'm saying? Instead of this way. Like, intuitively, that's what I, I see something. But anywho. With this full card, um, this is taking a leap of faith. This is starting something new, and I feel like it's this. It's this collaboration, whatever this is, you know, this is a collective reading. So, you know, you're gonna, it's gonna be really busy. So if you're starting a new business, if you're starting with these collaborations, these different ventures, your ass is getting ready to be busy. You jump right into a pew. Yeah, this is what you wanted though, Air Signs. This is what y'all wanted. Now your confidence is building up. Cause this is what you wanted the whole time. This is what you wanted the whole time. Be ready to receive. Queen of Swords. Somebody, an air sign could be turning their back on an Aries or somebody who has air in their chart or somebody who has air in their chart. Somebody is turning their back on somebody. There's something that happens over here and then there's something that happens, happens over here and it could be with the same person or more than one person. You coming out victorious. The queen of swords is holding that sword. Like she's victorious. If this is you, if this is what, you know, the energy that you're in, the queen of swords, then you're victorious. You, you've you let go of everything that pretty much does not serve you. That's what you're on. If you haven't done it yet, then you're on the path of releasing and letting go any and everything that does not serve you. Inwardly, more important, and outwardly. Some of you guys have went on some type of fast or need to go on a fast or a detox. Right? This is going to... You need to show the world who you truly are. Some of you guys have a platform or need to start a platform and show the world what the fuck you made of. Period. Period. Some of you guys are really close to getting there. Forgiveness heals. So some of you guys, this queen of swords, whoever this is to you, whether it's you or someone in your energy, there's some forgiving that needs to happen. 
from this person to others or from others to this person or from another to this person. This is also self-forgiveness. Because it's blocking, they said it's blocking your health and happiness. Okay? Yep, so Earth Signs, this is what I see for you guys. I feel like I was all over the place at times in this video, so forgive me, okay? Forgive me. But I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoy. If you're interested in a personal reading, my email address will be down below. I love you guys. Peace.